damn it! <sighs> really, Kirigo? Do you by any chance know the name of this? Because that sounds like something that I would love to read. That would be one of those things that'd be like, this really happened? Use my grappling hook or boomerang. Uh, do I look like Batman? Well, actually, when you look at my teeth like that, wait, can we get another view of them? Yeah, I'm Batman. Never mind, you're right. That is so much loot up there. Okay, wait, maybe if we stand on the uh, railing. No, don't jump! Okay, you've got to be making this up, Kirigo, but at the same time, I feel like you should rewrite our history books for this to be true. That or yeah, what... <laughs> Basically, I think what Chicken's saying is, it sounds like the plot of a really bad movie that I would probably watch. Okay, wait, loot showed up for a second. Maybe as, as I'm flying towards it, if I keep hitting the E button, we can get some loot. I know, I know. It's gonna end up being just, like, broken bottles or a rake or something. But... Alright, fine, fine, fine. We're... I wish I had my propulsion cannon right now. All right, fine. Uh, hi. Um. I want him alive. Alive. Ah! Oh. Ha! You're on fire. That amuses me. Assholes burn. That gives me a lot of joy. Hey, look, you're standing in gas. Why is it not at combusting? See ya. Who? Oh, hi. H who's that? Geralt. God, I'm hallucinating. Getting you out of here. No chance. We'll both die in here. Sheila. They captured her first. Her oh, shit. Critical. It's pointless. We'll never open it without the key. The warden keeps them with him at all times. I guess we're gonna have to kill the warden. Be right back. So I gotta say, one of my favorite things, or one thing that I really enjoy, is people who haven't played the second game running into the name of Sheila, because it's an interesting name. I'm saying. That was one thing that Pico pointed out, uh, one person who was viewing early on. Where, it, basically, uh, his thing was, okay, I'm pretty sure you've played the second game, because when you ran into her name, you actually knew how to pronounce it. You are not a sorceress. Or maybe you are. I don't know. Now, there's something in there, and I want it. Oh, man. Ugh. All right. I'm going to at least try to make it through this segment. Serious vertigo. Is it I E? Is it I? Is it, is it I? Is it I, I? If I had seen her name for the first time, I probably would have pronounced it C or Psy. Probably Psy. S S I L E. Maybe, maybe Siley. Yeah, Siley. Sleepy? No, I'm I'm a, a bit under the weather. I'm... <sighs> Just got some things going on, chicken. So something hit me pretty hard between this morning and this evening stream. So I'm hoping it's just kind of like a one-day bug. Uh, maybe don't want to go out there until we're ready. 
Hi. You guys got a moment to talk? Because I really need to kill you. You want me alive? I don't want you anything near alive. If I'm given the chance, we're going through this courtyard, even though it's not stealthy, and we're killing every one of these witch hunters. Every single one. Including the one that we saved earlier and changed his point of view. They all get to die. If he came back to this place, or if he came to this place, he's dead. The wondrous world of insectoids. Now, this was upstairs. Now it says it's even higher than where we are. I see no stairs. Are those... Mmm. Ah, sausages blowing in the wind. Uh, drinking nothing, Kirigo. Which is definitely a problem. You're supposed to stay hydrated, but I just don't... I don't feel like it. <laughs> oh, it's upstairs and outside. Wait a minute, is the... are those redanians? Oh, I'm sorry, but if you guys are here, we're gonna have to kill you. Hi, y'all, how's it going? Whoop! See ya! Alright, guy with the crossbow, though, he needs to die. Oh, look at that! You have to reload your, uh, crossbows! Interesting, that! You know what doesn't need to get reloaded? My sword! Yeah, cool that, huh? Oh, did the shield get a little hot? Huh. Yeah, it always sucks, Kirgo, but... But disease is so much fun, actually. Oh, don't lose your head over it. It's one Witcher, dude. Yeah, spells. Yell it out loud. Yell it out proud. Spells. Missed me. Missed! Whoopsie! Ow. He did not miss me. Ha! You're on fire! Yeah, gotta love those metal shields, huh? Yeah? It's hot? Oh, that's gotta be the warden. He's dressed in different way. You will not get me alive, dude. Oh! Nice skills. Alright, if you want to use that really long sling swing, I'm just gonna start you on fire. Like... Uh, to be fair, he only considers it a gift because, uh... Wait, Nurgle. Alright, you said Pop, and my first thought was, uh, Resident Evil 7. The old guy, yeah? No, his name is, a. Uh, Who gets John? James? Missed me. Yeah, now you did. Oh, we've got a lot of bodies to lose. We also gotta search around, because I see on my map it's still showing me that there's one person we haven't murdered to death yet. I'ma take you damn shackles, and I'ma kill you damn people. Yeah, you don't get to hide up here. Nah. You get to be dead. You get to be dead, and then I get to burn your crotch. Yeah, bleed. Bleed your blood. I made you bleed your own damn blood. Oh, Nurgle, the Chaos God of Disease from Warhammer. Sounds even better. Jack. Thanks, Digital. I can't keep track of all these names, especially when people demand using the same damn letters. Jesus. Hey, you know what? 
That should be part of the screening process, Kirigo. Oh, you want to be warden of this facility? Are you prepared to fight hundred-year-old mutants who are hell-bent on killing you? And he'd probably answer yes. It would be my pleasure to wield the dumpling sword of fate to fight any hundred-year-old mutants who come here to kill me in my evil shitty ways. And then put out my torches. Alright, this is the part where we realize we were wrong all along. This warden was a really good guy. We're going to read that note, and it's going to say something to the effect of, like, I've had enough of this damn church. We're going to reform the witch hunters from the inside out. We've been wrong all along. I'm going to read this, and I'm going to feel bad. Here we go. Prison the Third of Burke for use of magic admitted no guilt despite exhaustive interrogation. Died during questioning on the seventh, so they four days of torture. Arthur D. Vlester, prison the fifth for use of magic, admitted his guilt on the tenth day, sentenced to death by pyre, burned the day after. Here we go. Oh my god! Holy shit! Accused of practicing numerology? That's basically making the assumption that, like, the date of your birth has something to do with, like, what kind of a person you are. Coriel, imprisoned the 10th of birth for allegiance to Squiazil, admitted her guilt using crude language. Okay, that's fine. That's, just, that's great. So as we go down the list, it goes from using magic. Imprisoned for the use of magic amulets. Recommendation, fit to assist in guarding other convicts. Oh, okay. But not to be sharp, trusted with sharp implements. <laughs> Imprisoned for tax evasion. Enhanced interrogation? What the hell is that? Imprisoned for starting a bunch of fights. But unconscious due to sustained head injuries. Huh. Anyway, I... That was not... That was not a letter saying that this shitty, shitty, everything shitty needs to be reformed. Is this a way out? It is a way out. Oh, so if we wanted, we could just jump and then abandon everything and then be really shitty people. Ah! No. Oh. Really? Ran all this way. I mean, come on. Okay, let's think about what is the purpose for this outer wall. The purpose for this outer wall is probably... So this section here has nothing in it, so it's for the the storing probably of arms, because you have all of these windows, you could argue they're probably, like, murder slits, so that you can, like, defend this area. If perhaps there was a peasant revolt, or, or the horrible mutants rose up, although it took only one, but, uh, and instead there was a thread and a little bit of fiber. Yep. Makes, makes sense. Logical loot placement. Um, I'm one to talk. I, I don't care what it is. I'll loot it anyway. I'll take these old sheepskin. Did you know, oddly enough in this game, if you kill a sheep and loot a sheepskin for, from it, it is automatically an old sheepskin. Even if it is just newly been skinned. Oh, jeez! Oh, you're right, Digital. That would be the enhanced interrogation, because that guy has actually been there for days with that shirtless woman. He was torturing her, to be fair. And by torturing her, I mean he was going to pay her a very small amount of money to cut her some and brand her a whole bunch. It was a brothel he paid for an hour with her. And apparently his hour, he wanted uh, other services. 